Hey guys, in this video, I'll discuss about crude oil and now you can see 15 minute time frame and crude oil yesterday. So price was somewhere here. So according to my analysis uh, for intraday, not for positional trading, for intraday, uh, we are looking for a short, right? And I told in the morning yesterday, so we are looking for a short in this area and uh, our SL will be somewhere above this previous higher point, right? So evening, uh, till evening, you can see market was uh, in a sideways market. So somewhere here it was. So I told you just place your SL above this resistance line when I draw here around 4158. And target was near this previous lower point. So something I think uh, this candle was uh, trigger our, our target, right? So around 4087 that was our <coughs> sorry uh, yesterday target and you can see we uh, see that our target so now question is that after breaking this uh, supporting line can we go for further sell because here in 15 minute time frame they are creating lower low and the lower high we have seen lower low lower high and the lower low so when we are suddenly placing sell order that is very risky right so uh, if you want to see the previous market behavior the price is bouncing moving average from uh, 100 so have you seen this is 100 moving average price just drop 100 moving average price drop that means now price is following moving average 100 so if you want to enter for the sell you just wait to moving average uh, like that and at that time price will retrace toward this moving average 100 so when we will see this type of market behavior so we will go for sell again but question is that most of the people are thinking let me show you in a large time frame so large time frame we have seen somewhere 200 moving average are there and placing a strong uh, supporting line so why can see according to the previous market behavior we have seen some support are there support are there like that right and here you can see some higher point are there and forming a support so this call supporting zone so I always recommend you to do not enter in this supporting zone so these zone are very dangerous and most of the people are losing their money in this zone because they are not able to find out the zone so let's check in the daily time frame how they look like so daily time frame when we form like that now we can see this zone are forming in between this moving average there are many moving averages are and all moving averages are gathering and forming a strong zone are there so we can say from which moving average it might bounce from 200 from 150 from 100 or 20 but we have seen this is a zone and in this zone we never take any position that is the most important thing remember and this is called let me use some the professional technical uh, trading word this is called FOMO right I think most of the people are hard about this word FOMO right what is the meaning of FOMO most of the time I am using this uh, like uh, I explaining about that fear of missing out that is the most important thing and that is a uh, very dangerous psychology factor this is called fear of uh, missing out so uh, one by one I am using some hard technical word because last uh, I think who following our YouTube channel and most of the people comes to know how to analyze the market right how to draw the supporting line and then now I'm using some most uh, professional technical word like that so you just remember that type of word so sometime I'm not going to explain again and again so in that case I will use only that word for more out there like that here is a for more so we are looking for sell like we are looking for buy and not in between so like that what 
most of the people are using professional uh, trader are using that word FOMO right fear of missing what exactly are doing so let's check it uh, when I drone by connecting this uh, two line and by using daily chart and four hour and how it should look like in 15 minute time frame. let me tell you why it's happening now most of the uh, trader uh, who knew trader and uh, they don't have idea that much so they seen like price uh, running in a downtrend and uh, they broke this supporting line right so what is the logic behind there so people are start selling here in this area but they don't have idea here here is a FOMO uh, effect, affecting them right FOMO affecting how because they calculate because uh, the new trader are thinking I just looking for 20 to 30 pesa sorry rupees only or 30 to in crude oil you can say like rupees or some people are using point all are using in point or pips right so most of the people are using so they are calculating like that here if I enter here for the cell and here we can see 35 34 35 point are there I'm looking for only 10 point right let's see what happened so they broke this area they entered here for the sell and price is running like that and reverse again they place SL here somewhere and price hit the SL so they are thinking I am unlucky so that is not your luck that is uh, the view in this market is wrong so you just correct your hmm, what call in Hindi Nazaria Nazaria something like that they use this, right Nazaria like views on this market right so just little more above there only like uh, they place for 30 point market drop 25 point right 25 point and again reverse from this area they are say hey I'm unlucky only five point was to reach my level and boom market and again gone up so after next trade they are closing without doing trading ratio right that is called fear of missing and the fear of missing is best definition they are thinking if right now I'm not entering I'll miss this opportunity that is called fear of miss missing this is the most important highly affecting to the traders so that is why you always find out and exactly at what level you will enter in this market that is the most important thing right so always try to avoid FOMO fear of missing out so leave it right most of the people are thinking that I'm looking for 10 pesa oh sorry 10 rupees 20 rupees 30 rupees I will come up from the market but the market will sometimes they will not give opportunity to come up from the market they will reverse it right and and always remember you can't guess every point that is impossible right that is why we have to find out some entry point like entry point below 4030 for sell for the buy we are looking for to break out this level so after that people are thinking hey we have seen this is a huge point so how can I miss this opportunity right from here to here we have seen almost 130 130 point how can I miss this opportunity how can I lose this uh, uh, point that is called fear of missing right so they don't try to lose this point and entering in this market and uh, remember it is impossible to catch every point and most of the people are thinking everything there is no impossible everything is possible right leave it that concept many things are impossible right you can't be a North Korean president that is impossible right so 
some possibility a uh, related with our situation and time we are not uh, belongs from north korea that is uh, impossible for us to become a president right you can't be a uh, like a, uh, like that what call many things you, you have impossible right if i explain so most of the people are everything are possible but not for all so what is the possible uses find out right that is the most important so i think uh, so now we have seen uh, some like prices dropping down so we have seen like that uh, so let me show you the behavior how market will happen so you just uh, subscribe my another youtube channel so evening uh, session i will teach you most three important thing uh, like professional that are using so once you can uh, catch that opportunity so i'll uh, assure that at least 80 to 90 percent will be success in this market so three things i'll teach you one is market behavior how to find the market behavior second momentum and the third area of this market so it is working as a uh, we are combining three things, uh, price action method and three things, right? So now let's check it here when price will drop like here and they will retrace and at that time, which moving average so currently they are falling 100 moving average. So 100 moving average will be here. So like that, 100 moving average. So at that time, the sell opportunity will, uh, will be uh, appear here right so if suddenly they break this level so wait to retrace again toward this zone so we will start selling so i hope you enjoyed this video if you like this video please like and subscribe thanks for watching